Hello guys, we're back. Some more cyberpunk and let's get back into it. So we did we just did the stealth mission. Like trying to help all the all the getting to Hanako-sama. It didn't go too well! He had to uh, to put a dark sleep on her or something. To put her to sleep and now we're gonna see what's gonna happen. We gotta go to the hideout, so let's go. Okay, come inside, quick. I fear they had a coach. Nah, they can't catch me. Uh. Now are you gonna tell me what the fuck you were thinking? Uh, are you mad? Wait. Well, sorry, sorry. Oh. I was there that night at Kampeki Plaza. I saw Saburo Arasaka die. He wasn't poisoned. That's a lie your brother made up and spread. Yorinobu is the murderer. You must be mad to think I will listen to such nonsense. Mm. Why? My word means shit to you? Hanako-sama, I apologize on his behalf. Oh, no, shut no. up, girl. Yeah, exactly. Don't You're apologize. supposed to be honest. Well, that's what <laughs> I'm being. Fine. Maybe I am just a two-bit thief. But I'm the two-bit thief that stole that fucking relic off you. Slotted it in, took a bullet to the brain, died. You... died? Oh, yeah. And now I got Johnny fucking Silverhand in there, and I'll do anything to get him out. So I got exactly nothing to lose, but you got lots. Hanako-sama, he is living proof of the terrible crime your brother committed. We can confirm every word he speaks, if only you will help him with the relic. Hanako-sama. Come on, say something. Did you hear that? Go and check. Oh no. Oh no. Damn. Oh, we're screwed. <clears throat> I got a bad feeling about this. Damn it! Damn. Oh, Jesus. What happened to Hanako? Damn. I didn't. Last chance to get the fuck out of here. Takamura. Can't leave him back there. Forget him, guys. Toast. Unless you want to wind up like him. Nah, nah, nah. I'm gonna help him out. How do I help him out, though? Okay, we fell from here. Okay, we save, we save him now. You will die here with me. Thank me later. Need to find a way out now. Fast. There are empty rooms to the right. It's our only chance. Jesus. He, he, does he come? He can't come down, can he? You fucking come. Well. Just come, bro. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ok, 
Okay, okay, nice. Good shit. Keep it going. Keep it moving. Can you please come down, bro? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come down! Please! Enemy contact. Oh, and the enemy just disappeared. Just like that, okay. Oh, shit. Be careful. <clears throat> we must go different ways. How long we have a better chance? Really? Seriously? Then go. Seriously? Yeah. I just said you're gonna leave me alone? Come on. Oh. I went all through, through all that trouble just so you left me alone. Seriously. God damn it, bro. Come on. That's not fair. Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck ups like us? ACs busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? We're a couple miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just <sighs> keeps driving. Somebody going there sleeps in the damn city. What good's a motel in the middle of nowhere? Johnny, shut up, bro. Yeah. Shut your gonk mouth, please. Same random shit ain't gonna help anyone. How the tables have turned. Johnny, for crying now out. We're the ones sitting around waiting for Sokka assault squads to storm in. Anyone knocks, blast the fucking door. No warning. And if it's Goro. Who are you kidding? Been 24 hours since we split up. Complete radio silence. Rest True. in peace, bastard. Saw him yourself. Even without his implants, he was a good fighter. He'll pull through. Doesn't matter how good you are in Night City. On your own, you're fucked. I mean, we've managed quite well. Hear that? Car. At this hour, in this place? Fuck. Just one? Finger on the trig, V. Come on. Fingers on the trigger. Not a word. I have a message for V. Don't touch that door. I know you're in there. Who is it, huh? Fuck's sake. Who's there? Shit. I said, who's there? Oh, want the whole motel to here, or will you let me in? I'm armed. Don't try anything. Finally. Who the Ugh. fuck is this? That on the wall, is that... Blood? Yeah. Knock the last star off this dump. So, you were saying, got a message? Sitting right here. Oh, it'll start soon. What'll start? Oh, is she one of the dolls? It's a doll. <clears throat> yeah. Or a proxy. I must make one thing clear. I still think you are mad. But... Hanako, that you? But I can fool myself no longer. I believe you. Okay. So now that you know and believe, I have asked the what's next? Me, uh... Yorinobu planted a tanto in the corporation's very heart. I must act while the wound is fresh, and you will help me. You are living proof of his crime and treason. Decided already, is that it? You're in no position to set conditions. And what if I... obliged you to cooperate? Have to send a swarm <clears throat> of proxies to do that. This here, talking, is because you're alone. You don't have anyone else you can turn to. This is true. So what are your terms? Want to know everything you know about Mikoshi. 
Mikoshi. One of my father's flagship projects. A data fortress with servers situated on orbital stations all around Earth. <clears throat> Think of it as an archive of personality constructs. Digitized psyches. Try a prison. A matter of perspective. In any case, that is not where you will find salvation. Not without extensive knowledge of the relic and the construct creation procedure. Managed to make contact with Alt Cunningham. The Cunningham? The very same who invented Soul Killer. Using her modified version now. That should be more than useful. Track down your runaway. Hellman was hiding under Kang Tao's wing. We chatted. Think sooner or later, the engram will completely consume me. Process can't be stopped. A surprisingly deterministic conclusion for a man of science. At the very least, I got my hands on the relic schematics. Got detailed information about its inner workings. Project tech documentation. All useful. Even more so, given that Hellman is still alive. I will contact him and explain that one does not leave Arasaka by the back door. That's about the extent of what we've got. What now? Let us meet in person. At Embers, in the city center. It is discreet. Just remember one thing. From now on, we both must exercise extreme caution. That's my job done. Know what? What? Think I'd have rather had a wave of Sokka beats barge in here. We got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanukkah was living in a world that was completely safe for her. What she got on her hands now? A foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. It's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she's shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Oh, just the sound of her attaching her leash. Uh, br lol. What the hell? What's up? You got a few more words about the porcelain cunt? Jesus, what is going on to us? Shit. Get ready. What is happening to us? I mean... Fuck. Oh, we're in bad condition, bro. We are in oh. awful condition. Ah, uh, Johnny. You ain't dying yet. I got you. You got me, how? Jesus. We are in an awful condition. Oh, we're Johnny Silver and now, aren't we? Uh, Johnny. That smells the sea breeze. Oh no, I know, I know. Okay, never mind. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. What happened? How are we here? Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. You're right. Hard to take my eyes off it. We in the Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia. We're her sole guests right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Why, why bring me here? Of all places. Give me a minute. You'll see. Okay. You took over. Couldn't just leave you there, could I? <gasps> nice to be behind the wheel again. Honestly, never felt better. <laughs> like in my life. <sighs> I got you. No talking your way out of this one. 
you want it to pop the pill. Gonna pretend you didn't say that. Oh, fuck off. I know what you are. Hey, I saved your ass, got you out of harm's way, and you're still gonna doubt my intentions? Okay. Uh, I believe you. Thanks. I'm gonna believe him because he got his tire. He could have just popped the pill, I think. Maybe not. Climb through the window. Can manage that. I think. <laughs> we'll see. You wanted to know why I brought you here. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. Yours, they were belong to you now. Why are you giving me these? Imagine we're deployed together, fighting in a war side by side. Would you take a bullet for me? I, I don't know. Answer me. Ah, I would. Yeah. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Been thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear, I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get wiped. Tags are proof of my promise. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna be nice. I do the same for you. Yeah, thanks. You seriously considering Hanako's offer? I don't think I've got another option. Got a better idea? Not yet, but I got a request. Well? Adam Smasher, fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero, gone, tossed into the wind as mulch. Seriously? Smasher? He suddenly comes to mind? Last time we saw him, Didn't we... have a chance to say hello. That's why we gotta find him. Finally end this. That your dying wish. Revenge. It's more than that. And I'll need you to take Rogue with you. Jesus. It's important to me. And it's just as important for her. Okay, okay. So, I gotta tell Rogue... Everything? Jesus Christ. Think I'd better do that. Handle it personally. You'll drop the pills from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. I'm not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out. I promise. need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth. See if she's willing to help. Hey, Satan kicked me out of hell. Thought I'd swing by. All I gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days. Easy. Just like that, easy. Fine. I'll do this. For you. Appreciate it, thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise. You won't regret this. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. Okay, we're the hotel the pissed to Sophia. That right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today. That was nice. Now we're meeting Hanako at the embers. Spare a veteran some change. There you go. All yours. Now I gotta get to Hanako. Let's 
see you guys soon. We're back and uh, I guess we reached the final point. I didn't even realize we already got to the final mission. That was fast. I've done a lot of secondary missions on that, on that stuff. Can't actually believe we are already in the end. Don't like this at all. Ooh. This poor son bitch is the worst kind of news. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, first sign of trouble be Delta. Oh, says everything to go wrong. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now... I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it. Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Hmm. Ties that bind. Yes, family. Okay, okay. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Oh, guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard. It'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout. When my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Okay. Did you bring <clears throat> Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Seem on edge. Something got you spooked? I... don't know. Mm. Three times now, that AB has flown by. Think someone might have tailed you? We must not get distracted. Oh, Jesus. Did you bring Take Soul me for Killer? a fool. Think I'd fall for that. Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. Hmm. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning? Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do. And one is very near. Where? Here in Night City. Beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Oh. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. Yeah, I want to listen to this. This is going to be a disaster. Probably, but still. Sit. 
We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Mm. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. <laughs> you want Still kill. You want him dead. <sighs> I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. Oh, no. I will get you <clears throat> into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify. Oh. Listen. Mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Fuck. Oh, Jesus. Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, yeah, it's just dumb. Um... You are bleeding. Damn. Fuck. The relic. It seems you are running out of time. Seems like Don't it. Don't delay. Uh, Make your decision. I'll think it over. Oh, we're in terrible you condition. Can use some air right now. Oh, let's go, let's leave. <coughs> Shit. Please let us leave. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, don't, do not fall in there. I warned you. What? What are you doing? What am I doing? I'm showing you what it's like to feel fucking trapped. What the hell? Asked you, warned you, but you've insisted on not giving a shit. Now this porcelain cunt's gonna use you in her fancy scheme. Fuck off. I haven't agreed to anything But yet. I know you still don't understand oh, no. how these leeches operate. She met you face to face. She revealed her plan. She sunk her teeth deep into you. Not gonna be able to pry yourself out. Got any other ideas? I'd love to hear them. No? Then shut up and back off! Hey, you'd better relax. I am fine. Great, you checking out again? Oh, Jesus. We're in great trouble. We are in great trouble. <sighs> what am I? No, that's not what you say. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. Beta halo. What the but heck? Light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. How... how'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. <laughs> Delamant was your guardian angel. What the hell? Huh? I, uh... wasn't completely myself. I know. And that's a bit worrying. Give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. I think I'm getting some feeling back. 
for the history books. Hmm. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. <laughs> Do I have to spell it out? Yes. It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah, what about it? You'll find the last dose of pseudo endo in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you and you alone. On your own terms, huh? Oh, there's Misty. Never really realized. subtle there, Doc. Enough, Johnny. I just gotta think about it. Need, Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, it's in, not this in this basement. basement. What the hell? Christ, you're talking out loud. Oh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Uh, I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. And let me guess. My aura is sputtering. Mm hmm. Afraid so. All right, let's sure. Go. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. I just said something. <clears throat> Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, Jack? This is it, Chica. 
I'm done for. Hmm. Doesn't sound like the Jackie <clears throat> I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm -hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. Ah, that's more like it. Air. I brought him here. Hmm. Johnny always has to be here. See that? Wait, 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 I'll say it in a moment. Let me just grab this, this. I come here when this. I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Thanks, Misty. You were right. Choice spot. So what... What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Okay. Why is the... the thing still Fucking here? scared okay, me. Mind. Know that. Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Yep. I'm calling Pan Am. We're gonna call Pan Am. Pan Am. Just want to hear her voice. Sure as hell hope it's that and only that. Hmm. Mm. Hey. Pan Am, hey. Do you know what time it is? Won't keep you long. Just wanted to hear you. Hmm. You picked an interesting hour for it. Me? Okay, what's going on? To know that we'll see each other again. What? You know, fine. Fuck no, off. no, not like that. Jesus. Make up your mind. Something. Something I gotta do today. Gonna be high risk, big time. But I have to. What is it? It's not for comms. Not really. Then shut up and tell me where you are. In the city? Yeah. Okay, then plant your butt somewhere and wait. I'm on my way. You don't get it. I... I can't wait anymore. This has something to do with what you were telling me before? Yep. It does. Well, I'll say one thing. There's always a way out. Here's what you need to do. You need to take a few deep breaths. Then rethink all this. Hard. And then you can call me back. Do you know why? Because I am here for you. But... End of discussion. Well played. Wouldn't let me get a word in edgewise. Probably for the best. Would have said too much anyway. Was good you called. Wish I'd have had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think. It all started in a fucking landfill. Mm -hmm. Then you tried to kill me. Exactly what I mean. Here we are now, together, soaking in this vista, Night City. My only regret's that I won't get to see how it all ends. Gee, thanks. Got that little faith in me? <laughs> Not in you. In the rest of them. Listen. Want to trust Pan Am and her tarmac rats? Fine. But it'll be their lives weighing heavy on your soul. And if you take Arasaka's deal, well, you'll have your own soul on your conscience. True. Can 
gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Yep. We're gonna take that out. I'm gonna try this with Pan Am. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out, uh... Just wanna be there for it. Where? Well, it's gonna be fun. I'll see you inside, Makoshi. Johnny? Okay, just me now. Ready to talk? Ready. Yes, sir. I'm glad to hear that. So tell me. Need a way into our socket tower. Now. Sorry, what? No. I'm serious. Whole thing with Johnny? I don't do something soon. I'm done. Gone. Slow down. First, why Arasaka Tower? The tech. Underneath that tower, they got an access point to... Well, odd as it sounds, a prison of souls. A prison of souls? No. Uh, this one will fly over the hollow. Mikoshi, that's its name. Only place Johnny and I can disentangle for good. It's my last chance. So, again... Just to be clear, you've called me at High Moon to ask me to help you break into Arasaka Tower, or you'll die. Pretty much. About the gist of it, yeah. <sighs> okay. What? Okay. Where are you? Vic's clinic. The Ripper? Right, I know where it is. Can you hold off on dying for a bit? I'll try. Give a shot, sure. Good. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to get you. Ugh. <sighs> Well, we're doing this. We're so close to the end. Can't actually believe we're already at the end. It's been a fun ride. Is that you, V? This might be a long episode. Or... Yeah, it's me. So what now? Wait for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Oh. Where's the cat? Oh. Who do we have here, huh? Is it the same cat? That's Mr. Brightman. We found the poor guy in the trash behind the clinic. I think he misses Jackie. Ain't alone. You have to wait. Mind if I give you a reading? Hmm. No, probably not a good idea. Whatever you prefer. Perhaps it's best. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'll just put on some music. Okay, now I feel bad. I should have listened to it. God damn it. That's for you. Yep. No mistake in that ride ever. You scared me, you know that. Jesus. Didn't think anything could scare you. Hey. We're here to help, okay? Come on. Everybody's waiting at camp. Yeah, let's go. Look out for yourself, V. It's gonna be a fun ride. We're getting into Arasaka Tower. Can't believe it. <coughs> Welcome back to the living. You feeling okay? Um, 
I guess. Mighty good to hear. You had us worried back there. You passed out and we couldn't shake you awake. It sure does seem like your uh, condition might be getting worse. Yeah, Pan Am asked me to keep an eagle eye on you. Where'd she go? She's off debating Saul. You need help. That's clear. They sat right down to figure out how we might do that. Come on, I'll take you to see him. So, V, I heard talk that there's a war coming. Fred, I don't got a choice, Mitch. Looks like we don't have one neither. Can't say I miss the whole it. clan knows we set out tomorrow. They know why, what our aim is. Look around, V. War tested <laughs> veterans are a fistful at most. The rest mostly raid rinky dig convoys and salvage scrap. So for now, they only know as much as they need to know. The, plan is solid, the aim is to help you out. The waters. Not now. We're sending this clan to its grave. Fuck, you think I don't know that? And yet you seem to think you can change something by chewing me out like you usually do. V, finally. How's your health? Been better. So, what have you guys patched together? We still have details to iron out. But we know the who, where, and how. Have a look for yourself. A few strategies we sussed out. But only one grants us a decent shot at penetrating Arasaka Tower. We'll dig a tunnel. Okay. So you want a tunnel into Arasaka Tower? I know how it sounds. But we'd be plumb fools not to take advantage. I see Night Corps building a new maglev line in the area. Granted, it's guarded by Militech, but they're nothing we can't handle. Once we're in that tunnel, it's just half a mile to the substratum levels of Arasaka Tower. They're using one of Night Corps' cirques. We only need a few minutes to dig that distance. Not bad, wouldn't you say? Once we're in, we'll have to improvise. Guards, security measures, the fastest way into Mikoshi. We'll take things as they come and hope for the best. <laughs> v, any thoughts? Plan, entire op. It's about heading into enemy territory. You'll make enemies of Arasaka and others. So it appears. I'm exposing you, all of you, to danger. Want out, want to cut your losses? I'd understand. No hard feelings. You came to us for help. We decided we'd provide it. Our minds are made up. Okay, okay. No more discussion needed. It's settled. We had best get to work. I'll talk to our brothers and sisters. Get a drone buzzing over that site. And I'll check with Mitch. I think I know how to even the odds against Militech. Come find us later. I'll leave you in Saul's hands now. Just no making decisions without me. Sure thing, boss. Is there anything else you need? We need a decent net connection. Someone I know can help us get into Mikoshi. Who might that be? Alt. She's... It's... An AI. From... Out uh, past the black wall. Are you fully present up there? Why in hell would an AI help us break into Mikoshi? Because I'll ask it to. <laughs> Nicely. Fuck maybe. You know what? Fine. We're up to our balls and dung. Anyway, might as well go deeper. <laughs> might as well just go deeper. Find Dakota. She'll get you geared up. No questions asked. Thanks, Saul. Thank me once we get out of Mikoshi alive and in one piece. Bro, this motorcycle looks so good. Love it. I need to sell some stuff, Jesus. That America's long gone and forgotten. You might as well have started with fellas. We heard we're gearing up for a minor war. More like a suicide mission. Finish it up here, all right? Lo and behold, isn't this? In theory, we fitted an afterburner and a multi RPG launcher up top. We also scooped out about 60% of its total mass. Beautiful, isn't she? You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. Okay. Afterburner. Standard nitro or military grade? Standard couldn't move this baby an inch. So hardware's military. But how the hell did you cram all that into a panzer? Oh, small beans compared to the tricks we pulled with Scorpion during the war. When we unleash this beast tomorrow, 
You'll see. Okay. Firepower up top. What is it? A rapid fire 70 millimeter multiple rocket launcher coupled with an onboard MMI you can sync to via personal link. Where'd you get all this stuff? Teddy salvaged it from a scrapyard. The launcher itself was fine. The problem was no ammunition. Okay. Just let me talk to Dakota. As luck would have it, Dakota procured some. Don't ask me how. Do I? Do I have to talk, talk? later then, I guess. Wait, do I have to call her or do I have to meet her somewhere? I am confusion. What about messages? Nope. Oh well, we're just gonna talk to him. Since tomorrow's a big day already, how about we take it for a spin now? Want to get a feel for her over the terrain? Sure thing. Maybe after sundown, though. We still have a few loose screws to tighten. That's putting it. That's putting it mild. Will you quit being such a sourpuss? We'll have her ready in time. Okay. Let's talk to the coda now. Hey, Dakota. It's been a long while. What is it you need? Need a strong rig for a little jaunt on the net. Okay, get in. Ice filled tub. Favorite bit. Oh Jesus, that's cold. Carol, here to help Dakota? Evidently, I'm here to help you today. You good to go? Can't say how long this is gonna take. Whatever happens, stay cool, all right? Even if you look like you're about to flatline? All right, time to move. Follow the vectors, bro. Jesus. Hello, Alt. You come alone. Johnny's currently indisposed. Currently? He is buried deeper. You treat him like an unwanted passenger. A backseat dreamer of a world not his own. Had no choice. It was the only way I could come here, meet with you. Repression. You are good at this, and improving. Hmm. Let me get this straight. Mean to say you only agreed to help me because of Johnny. And since he's not here this one time, you're thinking of backing out. I do not aim to back out. I have my own intentions for Mikoshi. Because mm -hmm. for a second you were displeased, and I seemed a side note to all this. To observe the two of you interacting. Informative. Need your help, Alt. Don't got a lot of time left. You truly believe time to be your greatest concern. Yes. You exist, but you do mm -hmm. not exist. Two states of being separated by death. Matter of perspective. Think what you will, but seems to me I rose from the dead. Only question is, what now? You believe you cheated death. It is death that has cheated you. You are in between. You will begin to understand, but only in Mikoshi. What should I expect there, in Mikoshi? A boundary to cross. In all likelihood, the sole moment of your life when you feel the true weight of your existence. A burden for which you cannot prepare. And Johnny? What happens to him? I lack the data required to answer this question. Is there anything we can know for certain? Yes. That Mikoshi will be no more. Constructs imprisoned there. Gonna set them free? They will be integrated with me. Constructs will be integrated? Mean you're gonna absorb them? Assimilate? 
No wonder you jumped at this chance. You want to destroy Mikoshi. Swallow all the psyches in there. Mikoshi is a prison. Through me, they gain the chance to become part of something greater. Hey. Okay. Wasting time talking. Let's just do this. There. I sent a program to your Netrunner's shard. Once inside Mikoshi, use it. It opens a secure connection. Okay, what am I supposed to do with the shard? You must slot it into an access point. I will take care of the rest. This meeting will not be our last, should you succeed. Okay, let's go. Let's get into it. We got him back. Carol, the shard! Relax, child. You barely jacked in when your temperature went skyward to almost 100. The tech started acting as if infected. No. Stranger. Spookier. What happened here? You melted half my tech. That's what happened. Neural activity Jesus. spiked sharply. Your frontal lobe was seconds away from flowing out your ears, babe. I could just as well have popped a bullet in your head. Are you sure you're all right? Peachy. Good. Oh, I, I want good. to apologize, but okay. The shard. Wrote some soft I need to one of the shards. Please. We're surrounded by ice. Even if something punched through, my controllers would have. Holy. Get it away from me. No. Thanks, Dakota. Don't thank me. Find Saul. He came around looking for you. On my way. Saul, you want an award? Hop up here. Jesus. We going somewhere? All right, V. It's a simple matter. We, all of us standing here, owe you. And it's a great debt. Speak for yourself, Saul. <laughs> but in spite of that, you're still an outsider. A mercenary from Night City. What might as well be another world. Hey, ask Pan Am. She knows. So it's about time we fix that. A downright injustice it is. It needs fixing. You're gonna be an Aldecaldo. Which means this family will go to hell and back for you. Ready, kid? Do your worst. Let's go. You're one of us now, B. You're an Aldecaldo, damn it. Right there. Thanks for everything, V, and don't worry. We'll get you into that Makoshi. Isn't that the Welcome way? Welcome to it? the family. Welcome to the Jack, it's incredible. See? He likes it. <laughs> Listen, as soon as we're back from Mikoshi, we'll celebrate. And I know just the place. My treat, of course. We'll hold you to that. Don't worry. It's but a formality. You've been a de facto member of this family for a while now. You saved my rumpus, and as Bobby tells it, Mitch's too. I won't even mention Pan Am. Go to hell. <laughs> Saul's right, though. I mean, let's face it, V. My life was in a million pieces. You broke it into a million more. But sometimes it's only then that you can piece it together again. All right, fam, listen up. Today we celebrate, but tomorrow we're shaping up to be a hell of a day. To well, am I? Whatever needs doing. Then get some rest. A raid is a raid. This is still your night. Some basketball in the found glory. Could have given me a heads up about this. And ruined all the fun. Are you kidding? Oh, Are you Jesus. All right? yeah. There we go again. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. And how's the jacket? Not too tight? Snug as a glove. Feels like I've been wearing it a while. Don't you think you have? You earned this jacket. And the Aldecaldo's devotion. <laughs> 